What up guys, su compa Giovanni Welcome back to the Requintazo Podcast Ya tiene rato que no hago uno But I wanted to make one And the reason why I wanted to make one Was because Like I get a lot of messages Like I'm glad that I'm inspiring a lot of people To like start their own business Or follow their own dreams and stuff But like I'm always gonna be straight out with you And, and I don't, I'm not a bad person I don't want to be like the person who the dream crusher i don't want to be that person i don't want to be the person that says oh you can't do this or you can't do that because um i think anything's possible but you have to think rationally and a lot of people don't think don't think like that right so please listen to this with an open mind i don't want to crush your dreams and stuff that's that's not my my purpose like i'd rather tell you the truth and be honest with you and be like oh that's a bad idea or or be like that like because I don't want you to waste your time or money following something that may not help you out in the long run. All right, so the other day, my friend, he he's always seen my my content and he was like he was like, "Hey Giovanni, well, I want to start my own business and can you help me out?" And of course, I'm going to help him out. He's my friend. So he was like, "Okay, I have some business ideas." And uh, before I tell you what his idea was, guess what his business what, what he wanted to do and if you guess sell shirts then you're right and that's what a lot of people do when they first want to start a business they're like oh i'm gonna sell shirts and i think it's because they think it's gonna be super easy they, they think oh well, i just have to make a logo put on a shirt and people will buy it and honestly i'm always gonna tell you that it's not that easy like if you want to start a business it's not that e- it's not as simple as just making a product and selling it same if you want to be a musico it's not the same as releasing a song and becoming famous if this is your dream dude you have to realize that it's not going to be easy it is possible but it's not going to be easy and you can't be competing with these big labels or these big companies because we don't have their money and we don't have their resources so we have to think differently and honestly i felt like so bad telling my friend like the honest truth like what i actually thought because like I don't want to be the bad guy and I don't want to be that guy the dream crusher <laughs> but I didn't want him wasting his money or his time following this passion like I'd rather tell him the truth and and help him out start like a successful business something that will actually make him money so I was like honestly bro I I tried to do a, a sure business in the past I'm not saying it's impossible but but it's extremely hard and I gave him some tips and stuff and like there's there's two types of people like if you're the person who's always like hustling and you don't need someone to tell you what to do and you're not like you're always doing shit like you're actually doing shit then those are the type of people who I recommend to follow my advice because my advice I don't recommend everyone to follow it because if you're the type of person who always needs like a boss like that there's nothing wrong with that like you're probably a hard worker you probably work harder than me but if that's you and you need someone to tell you what to do then then um then you you're probably not cut out to be an entrepreneur or a business owner or a musico even because as a musico you have to hustle hard especially if you don't have a label helping you out like you just have to hustle and that's one of the things i noticed in him and not just in him but in general and the thing that stops most people is not other people most of the time the thing that stops you is you your own thoughts because i gave him this advice and i told him okay well if you honestly want to do this all you need to do is make a website and hustle hard dm a whole bunch of people and be like oh you want to support me and buy my shirt and after i gave him all this advice he was like okay thank you Giovanni I'm gonna keep on doing more research and as soon as he said that I said stop dude you're thinking too much you're doing way too much research you have to stop thinking and actually do and that's what I mean by your own thoughts are usually what's stopping you maybe you're stopping yourself because you're scared of what other people are gonna think maybe you're scared of trying and failing I don't know what's stopping you honestly that's something you have to figure out by yourself what's stopping you 
And every time you want to start something, like every time you want to go for it and go for your dreams, notice what's your first thoughts that come into your mind. One of his thoughts, one of his negative thoughts that stopped him was that he said he wasn't good at social media. And I told him, bro, well, if you want to do a successful business, it doesn't matter what it is. You have to learn how to be good in front of a camera. And he was like, well, I'm not good at that. And that's what I mean. Like, I wasn't good at this either when I first started. It was only through trial and error, trying, practicing every single day almost, being in front of a camera and recording. That's how I, I kind of got used to it. And he was like, well, you're already good at it. And I'm like, no, I'm not. And he's like, yeah, you're already good at it. And I'm like, no, you, you could always improve. Like, it doesn't matter if you suck. If you see my old videos, I, I think those are cringe. I think those are cringy and I don't like watching those videos but people obviously like them because that's how I grew my channel and I every time I watch my videos I always find something I could improve on like there's no finish line you could always improve you have to keep on moving forward be like a shark always be moving forward you're gonna die and that has to be your mentality always move forward don't let anything stop you don't let your own thoughts stop you alright next time you catch yourself having these negative thoughts i just want you to notice them accept them and be okay with them and keep on doing whatever you were going to do don't let those stop you because we're all going to have those negative thoughts even i have those negative thoughts still but i don't let those stop me well i'm gonna end this podcast right here hope you liked it please solo te pido una cosa please share this podcast so i can help more people And I'll see you in the next podcast.